Hello everyone, welcome to this uh, basic overview of uh, Cloud Compare, a free to use open source software for processing, editing and analyzing 3D point clouds from LiDAR, photogrammetry and uh, terrestrial laser scan sources. Uh, its main use focuses on uh, direct uh, comparison between point clouds while uh, uh, more advanced features focus on point cloud classification, surface filters and uh, segmentation. Uh, you can follow the provided links within uh, Decode's Cloud Compare page for uh, download downloading uh, the, the latest uh, release. So, to start with, uh, We'll uh, import an LAZ point cloud file uh, either through the uh, file menu or by drag and dropping the file directly to the uh, main uh, viewport. The open last file window will appear with uh, options on standard. Uh, and extended fields uh, to be imported and visualized uh, tiling capabilities in case uh, you import a very large point cloud that you want to be manipulated as uh, multiple tiles and uh, finally a general info tab with a total number of points and uh, bounding box coordinates In most cases, we keep uh, default values and uh, hit apply. Next window uh, comes in very handy uh, for most cases when we import uh, georeference point clouds with uh, large coordinate numbers from coordinate system origin. Uh, the engine uh, apply. Uh, a global shift to the import data set uh, to move it closer to origin and uh, maintain coordinate accuracy. It is uh, very important to apply the same shift values for every point uh, cloud you intend to import within uh, the same session in order for it to appear in the right place uh, with uh, the relevant ones. Uh, we also suggest to keep uh, this checkbox, uh, this uh, checkbo checkbox checked in order to restore the original coordinates of the working point cloud uh, when you choose to export it. And uh, when we are OK with all this, uh, we press Yes and uh, the point cloud starts loading. After a few moments, uh, depending on the point cloud's uh, size, density and uh, computer hardware, uh, the point cloud appears in the main viewport when where you can uh, uh, rotate the view uh, zoom in or zoom out and also uh, pan uh, it comes in very handy to uh, enable uh, the iDOM lighting shader here in the to the right toolbar uh, to act to activate uh, a, a shaded effect uh, 
uh, when your your point cloud does not have uh, point normal information stored, uh, you can play with uh, the point size uh, up here, depending on the zoom level, to to make the this added uh, effect uh, conform with the uh, point cloud uh, density and uh, a zoom level. When you zoom out, you can uh, make the, the point size smaller for the effect to be more comfortable. To the left side, you can reach the view toolbar where you can uh, play with uh, uh, default views uh, like uh, top down, front, left, and so on. And also alter between uh, orthographic pro projection, which is uh, this one. Uh, the default one or uh, uh, perspective view for the depth of field to be more uh, obvious. Uh, to move on uh, within the database tree window. Uh, you can see the list of uh, point clouds uh, imported. If uh, you pick one, uh, you can uh, check down here the, the main properties uh, of the point cloud selected, where you can uh, visualize uh, your point cloud between uh, RGB values, it's, uh, from a uh, photogrammetry, let's say, uh, scanning. Uh, mapping or uh, uh, visualize it uh, based on scalar fields, uh, which is, I believe, the, the main power of uh, of uh, cloud memory. Uh, uh, when you master uh, this option, you can uh, unleash the the full potential of this uh, software. Right now, we don't have uh, any scalar field here. Uh, but uh, uh, as a, a quick example, we can add uh, uh, the Z value of uh, our scalar field uh, of our point cloud here uh, and uh, visualize it as a scalar field from the edit menu, uh, scalar fields, export coordinate to scalar fields, uh, check the Z uh, uh, value here, hit OK, and uh, we have our point cloud uh, visualized with a color map uh, uh, of uh, uh, our surface uh, elevations. If you want, you can uh, uh, make the, the color scale visible here with uh, uh, elevation values corresponding to this color scale here. So, uh, overall, Cloud Compare is a robust solution for 3D point cloud processing and analysis with uh, constant support from uh, its developers and uh, uh, active users community. Uh, that's it for now. Please uh, tell us uh, what you think and share your personal experience with uh, the software. Thank you very much.